So, no surprise that the Apple Vision Pro took the internet by storm, with users showcasing their experiences in various stunts and videos. From wearing it, while walking on busy streets, to even driving a Tesla, the Apple Vision Pro has certainly garnered everyone's attention, and raised some concerns as well. And now YouTube is also joining the party, as YouTube spokesperson Jessica Gibby stated, We're excited to see Vision Pro launch, and we're supporting it by ensuring YouTube users have a great experience in Safari. Now, everything is great and fun until you look at the price tag and realize the Apple Vision Pro costs $3,500. With this much money, what can you buy? Let us guess, both the iPhone 15 Pro and a MacBook Pro. But here's the good news. Apple is also planning to launch an affordable variant of the Vision Pro, likely to be named Apple Vision Air, and it's going to be much cheaper. So, today's video is going to be all about Apple's upcoming Apple Vision Air, its price, and features that you might need to sacrifice for the price. So the first tip came out from the reliable tech analyst Mark Gurman, who believes Apple appears to be developing a sibling to the Vision Pro, the Vision Air and you must have already figured out how the naming is being done for the models. We have seen MacBook Pro and Air coming with similar processors before, yet there were multiple factors to differentiate them. That's also going to be the case for the Apple Vision devices. Now let's talk about the price. How much will the Apple Vision Air cost? According to Mark Gurman, the cost will reduce significantly and will be priced between $1,500 and $2,500. So for this, you have to understand a few things first. The reason behind the Apple Vision Pro being so expensive is the high cost of bringing this futuristic innovation to life. And now that all the features have gone mainstream, the production cost will reduce, eventually allowing Apple to cut down the price. There will be some more trade-offs to achieve such lower price points. We might have to sacrifice high-end features like the M-Series chipset and advanced eyesight tracking. The display quality might also be reduced along with a lower refresh rate. However, anything above $2,000 is surely not cheap, and the Apple Vision Air is still expected to boast most of the features for a compelling augmented reality experience. So, to make it accessible to more consumers, Apple really needs to stick to a lower price range. But when are we going to get it? Well, Apple has so far been able to make a solid entry in the AR segment. And to maximize its presence, it definitely needs more of its devices for consumers to get accustomed to. But still, it will need time for a robust app ecosystem for seamless productivity. Since Apple introduced the Vision Pro at the WWDC in June last year, we are expecting Vision Air to drop in this year's WWDC event later in summer. It's true that the Apple Vision Pro has paved its way into the future. It has become the doorway to immerse yourself in the world of virtual reality offering unparalleled productivity benefits, an immersive gaming experience, along with unique features. And with a more affordable alternative on the lineup, it is sure to change the world of augmented reality forever. So, do you think Apple should come up with Vision Air, or you would just be happy to buy the Apple Vision Pro? Throw all your thoughts in the comments, give this video a thumbs up, and subscribe to our channel to keep yourself updated with all the latest tech news.